Good morning traders, it's Friday, December the 9th and here is our daily market review. Equities in the US continued to climb higher on Thursday as the three major indexes gained. Weekly unemployment claims met expectations, a consumer sentiment reading from the University of Michigan will be published today, and a good outcome could help feed the bull market, which looks like it wants to continue its run upwards. The Federal Reserve's FOMC meeting will take place next week. U.S. investors have proven their confidence has significantly grown in the past month, and they may continue their buying spree today. A business survey index from the Japanese government for manufacturing proved positive this morning. The Nikkei has continued to gain today and the yen has weakened. Except for the Hang Seng Index of Hong Kong, most other Asian equity composites have moved upwards too. Inflation data from China released earlier also showed some improvement and market sentiment in Asia has stayed positive. The European Central Bank acknowledged yesterday concerns remain heightened about EU political uncertainty and, economic, and economies which continue to struggle. The euro declined rapidly against the US dollar and is testing important support levels again. ECB Mario Draghi has been forced to extend stimulus without a true timetable for any significant tapering of quantitative easing. European equity index did gain on Thursday along with the FTSE from London. The UK will release goods trade balance numbers, the pound also lost value yesterday, and traders should pay attention to the euro and British currency going into the weekend. Gold saw additional pressure on Thursday as global equities continued their surge and the US dollar strengthened. The precious metal is near important support levels and may continue to see speculative trading. The UK will publish its goods trade balance figures at 9.30 a.m. GMT and the University of Michigan will release its consumer sentiment reading for the U.S. later in the day at 3 p.m. Thank you all for watching and have a wonderful trading day, wonderful weekend and we'll see you again soon.